Welcome back guys to another Black Ops Domination gameplay on the map Crisis and look at me capturing C like a team player, that's a change for once. So sorry it's been another wee break, been a bit slack lately. Hope you guys have been well, hope you're enjoying yourselves. Should be the uh, holidays for you in New Zealand and Australia and all across the world. Um, this is a map that I particularly like, I like holding C a lot. Um, I will be talking about the gameplay mostly, with a couple of a couple of jokes and uh, quotes here and there, if I may, if that's alright with you guys. And um, I had a good feeling about this game because the game before I, I played it I was just so angry and I thought no, I'm going to calm down and I came back to, to have this gameplay and I, I die a few times, but that's alright, oh, there you go there's one. <laughs> And it's funny because this gameplay, I, I play really well and I can never get past the Blackbird. I get the Blackbird th three times and I can just not get past it. So it's, it's a lesson. You can run those high kill streaks, but you can't always expect to get them. And I think I had that problem. And I just I was just so angry every time. Uh, one, I get hit by the uh, Rolling Thunder. Uh, another time, I, a second chance. Just stupid shit that shouldn't have been been there and oh sit down uh that shouldn't have been shouldn't have happened shouldn't have killed me you know and this is a good thing i see a guy on the map to the left there and i'm like yep he's gonna go take c and being a sneaky little bastard i get him while he's at getting the defense points if you ever notice that there's nothing wrong with doing that i mean it's not gonna hurt anyone and a bit of that i think i stole his kill as well um like i was saying yeah there's nothing wrong with waiting for them to take to take the defense points, you know, uh, you get extra extra points against your name, you get an extra stat, something, and you're going to kill him anyway, so why not wait, you know, wait for him, and and I always do a little or cheeky, I hate to triple cap, because it makes the game go fast, and it means you can't kill as m many people, so what I do is I always run over the flag, and if you notice, you can hear them, the, uh, the commentator, I think it's Ice Cube or something, on this one, uh, I don't know if it's his team, or our team but if you run over the flag and, and they go losing a losing alpha losing bravo and then they they rush to it and you can sort of sit on the side and and see if anyone comes and takes takes the bait you're, you're planting the trap really i suppose you could say you seeing seeing who will fall for it and this i got bogged down here i was really worried because i thought yeah i'm on i'm on a high kill streak i think at this point and i was yelling at my teammates to come help me out, I only got one mag left, I didn't know what to do, and I didn't know if I had any more ammo, and I see there's a gun here, and I pick up another AUG, I hate the AUG, but, I'm sorry, I hate that AUG with the, the ACOG scope, but at this, I'm playing really sensible, I, I know we're losing two points, and I see my teammates are taking it, and the biggest way on this map that you'll lose A is coming from the side, so I thought, no, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put myself out there, I'll ambush anyone who tries to to stop us from taking A and like a team player. That was my thought of, about it anyway, that's why I did it. And I see a, a guy upstairs and this is why I hate the ACOG right now. The recoil is so bad as that small dot. I'd rather have the iron sights with that little bar across it and this is where I get the um the Blackbird right now, seven kill streak and use it. And the uh, rolling thunder just got me. Yeah, so it's kills like that, you know. I would have gone on easily, easily would have gone to Chopper Gunner and the um, the Cujos, the canines, the uh, puppies, the dogs. But yeah, it's not something you can get mad about. It happens a lot, and I deserve to die there. And I, I keep watching it, and I see. I'm like, how did I miss that guy? How did I not see him? And you, it's always easy to, it's always easy to look back and and say, well, why didn't you get him? But when you're playing at the time, it's it's much harder. And when you play with other people, you notice they're already telling you, go this way, go. Oh, do you not see him? Ah, oh, do you not see him? Why didn't you kill him? It's like, well, I didn't see him. But you sort of uh, watching these videos before I I commentate. I'm always watching them and going, ah, oh, how did I die? Oh, there's a bit of a criminal kill. And I get scumbag my own teammate here. I try and plant the claymore. I see him. I'm trying to run back, and he pushed me out. See that he <laughs> he blocked me. He used me as a blocker, but. Oh well, I'm not. I'm not too fussed about that. If he didn't die, I'll be happy. You know. And I don't know. I don't know what his name was, and I don't know on the 
I'll talk about it down the left hand side if he died or not, but I'll be so happy if he didn't die and uh, he tried to play a trick on me, I knew he saw the grenade, he was coming through there and once he once again like like this, I didn't see him and I should have killed him straight away. He was on the map. I didn't see him. But I, d I don't take A because they are spawning there, so I want to take out this guy and the same guy in second chance there, Wingman. He's he's trouble, he's no good, but I get the kill. And I go, nope, I'm not going to get A. It's always about using the map, I always say that, and picking off the sniper so I get a few easy four or five kills there, but it's all about using the map, I reckon. If you can keep one eye on the map, you know, especially with the spy plane, you know where, what's happening, where your teammates are. If you know where your teammates are and no one's firing, no red dots, you'll know where the enemy isn't. So you can run where, you are, where your teammates aren't and that will definitely be where the enemy is because they're not going to spawn right next to you. It's not Modern Warfare 3, which is a big concern of mine at the moment and I don't know what happened there and I tried to get the way and see once again the uh, second chance got me. Yeah, it's another, this second chance, final Sam, whatever you want to call it, it should not be in the game. Um, highly against it. I get the kill, but I mean, six, seven kill streak. And some guy, you, you kill him and he expects to come back to life and you kill him and he can get revived. I mean, that's not, that's not fair. I mean, this saying that is for the new players who don't know how to play because they always die and they want a, a second chance is what they call it, but what they should really be doing is yeah you can have it for your first 50 levels or 80 levels in Modern Warfare then that once you prestige it you, you're not a beginner anymore you've you've played a day you know you, you got used to the game it should be should be out why should it keep going if that's their reason that which is what what they're saying it is for the new players and and stuff like that and that's a shocking kill and I I'm always used to flat jacket we, you never get grenaded with flat jacket and I suppose I got a bit too close to that one but like I'm saying, why have second chance in if it's for new players and then keep it in for the tenth level prestige like that guy was that is still using it? It doesn't make sense, and a lot of people don't like it. And <laughs> bit of a sneaky kill there. He didn't see me, but I saw him. And once again, <laughs> I see the RCX and I see my teammate there, and and I was like, no, I'm not gonna die. I'm gonna run away, and he's gonna kill you. You're gonna take one for me, mate. Like, the amount of times I do stuff like that, I always. I always take one for the team. You can hear it, the gameplay. They've got an SR-71 here, and they have to see me. How can they not see me? And they should be throwing those stuns. They should be throwing those same texts. They shouldn't even be coming this way. If they know, if they see the guy bar in front of you die, you obviously know he's in a bad position to to come and get me. So why do it? You know, it's bad play by them. But I'm not complaining. I'm getting my kills. I'm taking advantage of my teammate's Blackbird, and as soon as that one runs out, I quite happily donate my one to the team on the, way. the best thing about this Blackbird is compared to Modern Warfare 3 that is it's, it's always on it doesn't wait for the radar to, to scan over it um, you, you're you always going to get a, a picture perfect view of where they are um, see like that it's dying down so double double kill now see to the how I got that one I don't know I'm always it's quite a hard one and the recoil on this gun is so bad but Anyway, the Blackbird, uh, it should be used more often, it's not, and I'm, I'm so happy it isn't, because it is such a, a highly regarded kill streak. you know, it's, I mean, this, this guy behind me, I don't know why I didn't see him, but I did deserve to die then, but this Blackbird, I mean, for the, for the individual player, for the person who's going for kills, the Blackbird is so awesome, I mean, you're always going to know where everyone is, um, you can't, you, they can't sneak up on you, there's no surprise in it. And I don't know what the hell happened here, just... What was he doing? What the hell was he doing? He was facing me, I saw him on the map, he was facing me. He, he must have thought I was a dead body, but... The quickness skills of Medic Mike... I got him in the end. Because anyway, this game's winding down, I think I go one more... <laughs> one more Blackbird. And then the game ends, so it doesn't really... Get used much. But, um... Hope you guys have been well. It's been a been a while since I've, I've chatted to you, and feel free to leave all the comments and please leave a like or a, or a comment or a subscribe if you feel that my videos are good and you enjoy listening to them. and And if you ever want to play Black Ops with me or or anything like that, <laughs> using the Blackbird with the uh, Counter Spy Plane, I'm renowned for that. I'm world famous for that. But like I was saying, if you ever want to play Black Ops, just add me. My gamer tag is 
my YouTube channel name, Medic Mike NZ. And um, I just wanted to get the extra 300 points for that. I know I don't need points, but but I thought I'd grab them anyway and get the last final few kills for that. And anyway, thanks for that, guys. Uh, it's been another Medic Mike presentation, and that's me out.